Alrighty, fellas, I want to talk to y'all about why you need to stop listening to sad music such as Juice World and Little Peep and stuff like that. Okay, a little backstory. So, from maybe 13, 14 till I was about 17, and a little bit here uh, now and then, I used to listen to Juice World, Little Peep, uh, what else? Trippy Red wasn't that sad, but like sad type of music. And I like Juice World, and some of his songs aren't sad, but a lot of his stuff is sad. Like, I totally forgot. I haven't listened to him in forever, but the one with the car, I don't, the uh, the album with the car in it. I, I feel really shitty that I don't remember. I can sing all of his songs, but I don't remember. Uh, Lil Peep, all of Lil Peep songs are really depressing and sad. And you might like the music, but it, it music impacts your mood. And what I've realized recently is, like, if I'm feeling anxious or a little, like, depressed or sad or just unmotivated even, I put on some music and it makes it feel better. Like, uh, there was a really bad storm uh, about a couple months ago. I was freaking out. I put on some music. I felt a little better. And I was like, dang, this actually helps. But imagine if I put on some depressing shit. I would have been terrified, bro. I would, it would have made it worse. And it's not like the music doesn't just impact you in the moment. It has lasting effects. Because, like, imagine that, like, you know, the sad, the the vibes, like, oh, I'm so depressed. I take drugs all day. Like, some, like, depressing, you know, lyrics, right? That goes into your brain. You kind of start thinking about that a little bit. Especially if, like, some guy's talking about, like, doing drugs or how his girl left him or something. Like, something depressing, right? That impacts your mood. And I've been listening to a lot of uh, more uh, uplifting music. Like, J. Cole, I, I love it, bro. His music is so good. Just the vibe, great. I listen to a lot of 80s music, like, uh, like Sunglasses at Night. There's some other one, Like, you know, the popular ones in, like, movies and stuff. Like, those are pretty good. I like listening to those when I drive and stuff. But you gotta listen to some better music, and it definitely impacts your mood. And Suicide Boys, uh, I know Devin and or he plays it at the gym a lot. But it's uh, Devin is the owner at the gym that I go to. A little backstory, but uh, basically, like it's the lyrics are really sad and depressing. And I, I mean, the vibe is decent because they because their music isn't really sad. But I mean, the lyrics are super depressing. And if you listen to them a lot. I feel like it just impacts your mood negatively. So the thing I want y'all to take away from this video is listen to some better music. I mean, you might love Lil Peep and Juice World and uh, XXX Tintasha. I'm not going to say his name, but that guy. Uh, and their music is good, and they have some, you know, uplifting songs. Like Juice World, I know he does. He has a lot of them. Like uh, his uh, A Death Race for Love, His uh, some of his songs are on that album are pretty good. But his other stuff, like uh, Lucid Dreams, that whole album that he had, that's not the name of it, but uh, I don't remember what it's called. But, uh, I don't even remember. But, like, it's depressing music, bro, and you don't want to be listening to that, because that does not, that, is, that can't be good for you. It's just listening to that sad stuff, bro. Um, I know there's, like, drill, that, uh, like, drill music, there's rap music, and that stuff is kind of good, but it's just, like, I, I'd rather listen to like older like rap music like that, like uh, uh, Notorious B.I.G., a little bit of Tupac, but like those are honestly just, I like them better, that's just personal opinion, but the stuff now is just like, I don't know, but that's just my personal opinion, listen to the newer stuff out that's out right now, it's about rap, it's just about murder of people, and I, I feel like that isn't good either, you want to talk about something good, like J. Cole, he has some pretty good stuff, and Something that's kind of motivating, like talking about how he was struggling and got out of it and stuff like that. But like some shit like like Suicide Boys, their lyrics, so depressing, bro. I wouldn't listen to that. So if you want to feel better and you're depressed, listening to depressing music does not fix it at all. Listen to some J. Cole or some, uh, who else? I can't think of anybody. I listen to a lot of My Chemical Romance, but that that's emo, but it's not like depressing. Like that's the thing is like it's, if you listen to My Chemical Romance, I know Deftones, uh, I, they're not really depressing. It's kind of like a vibe. I listen to it a lot when I'm uh, doing things, but uh, like it's it's just a vibe, and it, I like the I like Deftones a lot. They don't they don't have a lot of sad music. I mean, you could I guess perceive it as sad, but it's not like depressing. You know, I mean it's it's I like their a lot of their music, and they have some good songs. But uh, I'm trying to think of some people. J Cole, a lot of his his stuff. I mean, J Cole, you go on to Spotify, he has some really good songs. Uh, I'm trying to think of who else is is good. And there are some like sad rappers who do uh, make like good music like that, but um, Ski Mask, the Slump God, he makes some pretty. I don't listen to him a lot, but I don't know he makes like 
not depressing music. I'm trying to think of who else. Um, yeah, I don't know. I I listen to a lot of what is it like white girl music, like uh, not Taylor Swift, but like a lot of old like two thousand tens Lady Gaga songs, just because it it reminds me of my childhood and it's just a vibe. But uh, what else? I'm trying to think. I can't really think of anything off the top of my head. But I think I'm gonna call it for this video. So I hope y'all learned something. Don't listen to sad, depressing music because it impacts your mood negatively. You may like empathize with it, make you feel better, but don't. Just listen to some uplifting music because it'll get you in a better mood. A little tri uh, trick that I've learned for getting out of depressing mood: hit some push-ups, go on a run, uh, or you know, go do some cardio or something, and uh, go win at something. And like, of course, if you want to win at something, you have the chance of losing as well. So if you're like really depressed and you really feel shitty. Don't try to compete. I mean, you could if you're if you're not like a bitch. I'm not saying you're a bitch, but like a. If you like, sometimes I get really in a bad mood and I'm just like I fucking hate everything and I just I I wouldn't want to you know lose at something without making it worse. So you know, hit a quick workout, do some push ups, do some squats, do something like that. Get the blood flowing, you know. Uh, go win at something. And yeah, uh, stop listening to sad music. Listen to some better music that's not depressing and makes you feel bad. You listen to some good music that makes you feel good. There's a lot of, uh, I know Ice Cube, uh, It Was a Good Day, that song by him. I love listening to that. You know, wake up in the morning, listen to that. Sets the mood perfect. But yeah, I hope y'all like this one. Hope y'all got some little bit of advice. Anyways, see y'all in the next one. All right, I'll record, I'm recording this part after the, uh, uh, other part of the video. All right, so music recommendations. J. Cole. Kendrick Lamar, a little bit of Drake. I mean, Drake has some good songs, but I don't know. Um, he's a little bit too, I don't know, whatever. Um, Snoop Dogg, uh, Zillikami. Uh, Zillikami with Sauce Mula. Sauce Mula is, I don't like his, his voice, and he just doesn't have good lyrics, in my personal opinion. Um, there's uh, Scarlord. Scarlord has some depressing songs, but his songs motivate the fuck out of me. Um, I know there's a couple others, but Chief Keef. Kanye West. Kanye West has some great fucking songs. Um, there's uh, Panic at the Disco. That's a little less. If that's a lot different, I listen to that a bit. They're not like super depressing, but uh, I'm trying to think of who else. Yeah, that's pretty much. I mean, I, I have a playlist. If you want me to put my playlist, I might put it in the comments. Uh, if you know you want to listen to that, I have a gym playlist as well. Um, oh, Eminem. He's a lot of his stuff. He has some sad songs, but a lot. Of, I mean, Eminem is just. He's a very not broad artist. He has a lot of uh, range, I guess. His album, what is it called? Not beautiful. Uh, Relapse. That's that whole album is depressing. But there's some good ones. There's uh, his newer stuff is good. I I haven't listened to a lot of his newer stuff, but like a lot of his old popular songs. Eminem is good. Um, I know Lil Wayne. Lil Wayne. His lyrics are crazy good. Um, who else? Any of those like two thousands uh rappers? They're pretty good. Not, none of them are depressing. Just listen to rap, pretty much. Uh, that's what I would recommend. And yeah, hope y'all like those recommendations.